Now let's see how we can download and install Windows 10 operating system inside of Oracle's VirtualBox. Oracle's VirtualBox is a free and open source hypervisor. Using VirtualBox, we can install multiple operating systems in our base operating systems. As you can see, I have already installed various operating systems. Now let's see how we can create Windows 10 virtual machine in VirtualBox. In order to create Windows 10 virtual machine, we need to download the Windows 10 ISO file and we also need to download the Oracle's VirtualBox. Open your favorite browser and search for Download Oracle's VirtualBox. Now the very first link, it will be from the VirtualBox. Now click on Download Oracle VirtualBox. Now scroll down, you will see this option, Windows Hosts option. Click on it. This will start downloading the Oracle's VirtualBox. Now the VirtualBox is downloaded. Go to the location where your VirtualBox is downloaded. Now double click on the installer. Now press on next button. Again press on the next button. Select Yes. Now press on the Install button. Now make sure you check this Start Oracle VM and now click on the Finish button. Now we have successfully installed Oracle's VirtualBox. Now we will download the Windows 10 ISO file. In your browser, search download Windows 10. Now the very first link, it will be from Microsoft. Now click this link, download Windows 10. Now scroll down, you will see two options, update now and download tool now. Now select download tool now. This will download the installation media. Using this installation media, we can download the ISO file. Now go to the location where your media creation tool is downloaded and double click on it. Now select accept. From here select create installation media and hit the next button. Now keep it as it is, press the next button. Now from here select the ISO file. Press next button. Now you have to choose the location where you want your Windows 10 ISO file to be downloaded. Now press save button. Now this has started downloading the Windows 10 ISO. Now press on the finish button. Now launch your Oracle's VirtualBox. Now we will be creating a new Windows machine. Click on the new button. From here, you can give any name to your virtual machine. Now keep the folder as it is and in the type, make sure you select Microsoft Windows and in the version, select Windows 10 64-bit. Now leave this unattended install as it is. Select hardware. I will be allocating 10 GB of RAM to this virtual machine and I will allocate around 7 processors. Now select hard disk. Now leave the hard disk file as it is. Now I will be allocating 20 GB of my hard disk to this virtual machine. Now again leave the hard disk file as virtual box disk image. Now click on the finish button. Now select the Windows virtual machine which we created and press on the settings button. Now if it asks for permission, give all the necessary permissions. Now select system and here you can see we have allocated 10 GB of RAM. If you want, you can change it. Now select processor and we allocated 7 processors. Now you can leave as it is and select display. Now make sure you give the maximum video memory. Now select storage and click on this empty file. Now on the right side you will see this disk icon, click on it. And now 
select choose a disk file. Now from here you have to select the Windows 10 ISO that we downloaded earlier. Now press on open. Now you can leave all the settings as it is and press on the OK button. Now select the Windows 10 and press on the start button. Now we will be installing Windows 10. Now you have to select the language. I will keep the settings as it is. Press the next button. Now click on install now. Now select I don't have a product key. And from here you have to select which version of Windows you want. I will select Windows 10 Pro and press on the next button. Now accept the license. Press the next button. Now select the second option, custom install windows, select it. Now press the next button. Now it has started installing windows. Now select your reason, press yes. Select the keyboard layout, press yes. Press skip button. Now select setup for personal use. Click on next. Now select offline account. Select limited experience. Now you have to give a name for the user. You can give any name. Press next. Now we have to set a password for this user. Now you can give any password, press the next button. And now let's verify the password. Enter the password which we created and press the next button. Now you have to answer some security question. Select whatever question you would like and write your answer. Now press the next button, select accept, now skip, not now, and there we go. Now we have successfully installed Windows 10 in our virtual box. Now let's see how we can make this full screen. Go to devices and click on insert guest editions CD image. Now open the file explorer and go to this PC. Now you will see this option VirtualBox guest editions click on it. Now you will see VirtualBox Windows edition 64 bit click on it. Select yes. Press on the next button. Again press the next button and click on install. Now make sure you select reboot now and click on finish button. This will restart your Windows 10 machine. Now log in again. Now go to view. From here select full screen mode. Now our windows is full screen. Now we have successfully installed windows 10 in our virtual box. Now if you want to exit out of this full screen, move your cursor to the downward. Now you will see this menu. From here select view and click on full screen mode. 